here in this question we have this triangle and inside this triangle we have this smaller triangle here which is a right angle triangle this angle is right angle right angle is 90 degrees and we see these marks indicating that this side is equal to this side that means that this smaller triangle here this inscribed triangle here is an isosceles triangle remember the properties of isosceles triangle with isosceles triangle two sides are equal and automatically the base angles are equal this angle must be equal to this angle here are the base angles all right this angle here must be equal to this angle all right and we also know that sum of the interior angles of any triangle is 180 degrees if this is already 90 it means that this angle and this angle must sum up to give the remaining 90 and they are also equal it therefore means that uh, if this angle is a and this is b it therefore means that angle a is equal to angle b which must be 90 divided by 2 which is 45 degrees so each of these angles is 45 degrees all right so we'll be interested in this angle alone so angle a is 45 degrees all right now if we look at the larger triangle again sum of interior angles of any triangle is 180 degrees so we expect angle a plus angle 5x plus angle x to give us 180 degrees all right so we have angle a plus angle 5x plus angle x to give us 180 degrees all right 5x plus x is 6x so we have a plus 6x is 180 degrees all right we know a a is 45 45 degrees plus 6x is equal to 180 degrees take this 45 this way so we have 6x will be equal to 180 minus 45 180 minus 45 is uh 180 minus 45 is 135 135 degrees so we have 6x is equal to 135 degrees therefore the value of x will be 135 divided by 6 on uh, 135 divided by 6 will give us 2 6 to 13 is 2 into 15 is uh 2 all right into 15 is 2 30.5 so the value of x is 22 point five degrees.